Good afternoon, everyone. As I said on Saturday, I'm humbled by the trust and confidence the American people have placed in me and in Vice President-elect Harris. And we're ready to get to work addressing the needs of the American people. Today, that work begins. It starts with doing everything possible to get the COVID-19 under control. And we just received positive news in this fight with the announcement that there's been progress made toward a successful vaccine. As you work toward a safe and effective vaccine, we know the single most effective thing we can do to stop the spread of COVID is wear a mask. The head of the CDC warned this fall that for the foreseeable future, a mask remains the most potent weapon against the virus. Today's news does not change that urgent reality. We, I won't be president until January 20th, but my message today is to everyone is this. It doesn't matter who you voted for, whether you stood who, where you stood before Election Day. It doesn't matter your party, your point of view. We can save tens of thousands of lives if everyone would just wear a mask for the next few months. So please, I implore you, wear a mask. Do it for yourself. Do it for your neighbor. A mask is not a political statement but it is a good way to start pulling the country together. We have to do this together. Wearing a mask may seem like a small act. Maybe you think your individual choice won't make any difference. But throughout our history, throughout the history of our nation, we've seen over and over how small acts add up to enormous achievements. It's the weight of many small acts together that bend the arc of history. 